Next community conversation, and we are joined by Robert Gottschall, an actor at the Wayne Theater. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Yes, we are happy to have you, and you are in Jane Austen's Pride and Prejudice, adapted by Melissa Leilani Larson, coming up at the Wayne Theater. Mm -hmm. Tell us who you're playing. I'll be playing Mr. Darcy. Uh, and this is an iconic <laughs> character. That's a, that's a lot to take on, right? <laughs> a little so, pressure. <laughs> Mr. Darcy often seen as reserved and aloof, mm -hmm. but ultimately has really a depth of emotion. So mm -hmm. how do you navigate the complexities of a character like this? Well, that's a wonderful question. Um, I found that initially both he and I are rather introverted and as such I felt that, that kind of personal connection to him uh, from the get-go. Uh, and what I find wonderful about him is that he's a character of whom like much is said but very little is in his own words. Um, and so he pref prefers to avoid the center of attention and as such uh, trying to find those ob ob objectives to play uh, him, especially since he's so silent at the beginning of the play. I yeah. uh, was uh, kind of uh, an interesting uh, uh, thread to pull. Uh, since I uh, take the Stanislavski approach to a lot of my acting, I found myself uh, asking, you know, why does he stay silent in those moments that he does? You know, why doesn't he say things when he could? Or are there moments where he is about to speak, but uh, something or someone else stops him? Yeah. Um, and throughout the process, uh, I was asking myself questions like that. And I found myself um, interested in his physicality. Uh, what exactly is he doing with his hands is something that I've always been thinking about with any character, but with him in particular, someone who's always so reserved, off to the side. Um, I've been talking about uh, his fears and his anxieties a lot as well, because that seems to be something that really comes up into his character. And the director, Leslie Larson, and I uh, have been speaking about that in crafting the character. Um, so it's been a, a, a fascinating little process to, 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 to travel with him. Yeah, there's mm -hmm. so, so much that goes mm -hmm. into it. And, and we always talk about how there are so many adaptations of Pride mm -hmm. and Prejudice out there. What do you believe really sets this production, this adaptation apart? Well, what I really love about this, this particular production is that um, Melissa Leilani Larson has done a great job of uh, highlighting characters that we don't necessarily get a lot of time with. So with Pride and Prejudice, you always think about, you know, Mr. Darcy, you think about um, uh, uh, Elizabeth, you think about uh, her sisters. Um, but then other characters who don't necessarily get a lot of a fair shake or a lot of screen time uh, or, or page time, um, she does a good job of representing them and kind of giving us a, a, a very hum a human side to them that we don't necessarily see. So I think people coming into this, uh, especially you know Jane Austen vets, they'll see a faithful representation of their favorite characters, but they might get a little bit of a side of them um, in scenes that uh, Mel has written in uh, that are faithful to the character, but also kind of representing a side of them that we don't normally get to see much. Yeah, it's kind of like the best of both worlds, right? It's, it certainly is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, tell us, um, so we know this is coming up. Everyone's mm -hmm. really excited. When is this show coming up? So this show's coming up in the first two weekends of March, so March 1st through 3rd, and then 8th through 10th. Okay, perfect. And mm -hmm. then there's a lot of other stuff coming up at the Wayne, too. Mm -hmm. What else is on tap? So tonight we got Selwyn, Bir uh, Selwyn Birchwood playing, and then we have the music of Sam Cook playing uh, March 5th, and then on March 13th we have the Vienna Boys Choir. Awesome. Awesome. So, so many good things happening at the Wayne. Something for everyone. Uh, anything else you want to add real quick before we go? I'm really excited for everybody to see the show. Like I said, I think it's a great play. Um, it's a very wonderful cast. We're all loving it, and we can't wait to share it with everybody. Awesome. It's going to be a wonderful show. Break a leg, and thank you for being here. Thank you very much. Yes, we'll have you back soon, and we will be right back.